I'm Ron Marshallsey and this is your sports update. The baseball team lost to Natick, Zavarian, and Ashland this week. They'll be looking to get back in the win column when they host Dover Sherborne Monday, May 1st at 7 p.m. The softball team got the job done against Ashland, beating the Clockers 12 to 3. Their next game is also the first at home at 4 p.m. The Deadwood Lacrosse team had a very close loss to Hopkinton Wednesday afternoon, but their next game is May 1st at 4 o'clock at Dedham High School. The girls lacrosse team had a thrilling matchup with Bellingham Monday afternoon, beating the Blackhawks 18 to 15. NCM was there to watch three Mustangs score four goals apiece in this one. Olivia Naughton, Caroline Forrest, and Olivia Lodge. Lodge was a force on the field, winning face-off after face-off, and her second goal in the game was the hundredth of her career. Other Mustang scorers included Emily Femme, Emily Spadorsha, Leanne Sad, Bridget Sopel, and Shay Larkey. The team's next game is also the first, away at Norton at 6.15. The boys' tennis team lost to Ashland this week, but look to get the winning going when Dover Sherborne comes here to face off with them Monday the 1st at 4 o'clock. The girls' tennis team also couldn't get the win against Ashland, and they will also go up against Dover Sherborne on the 1st at 4 o'clock, but away at DS. Both the boys' and girls' track and field teams got wins over Ashland, with the boys winning 70-66 and the girls 83-45. Both teams' next meet is May 3rd at 4 p.m. at Holliston High School. The volleyball team lost against Nipmuc and Braintree this week, but they get a chance at redemption when Nipmuc comes here May 1st at 4 o'clock. And finally, former NHS student-athlete Janelle Kelleher was an incredible goalie for the girls' hockey team. Janelle played at URI and Boston College, and recently she was officially hired as the head coach for the Roger Williams Women's Ice Hockey Club Team. Congratulations, Janelle. And that is all I have for this sports update. I'm Ron Marshallsey.